Hello everybody, welcome back to another Venus Ninja episode, where today we are back on the Survival Series server. It's episode 58, I think, and today we are starting things off in the shopping district because there have been so many changes that have happened. So without further ado, let's walk through it. But before actually I do, I want to tell you guys right now to make sure to subscribe to this channel if you enjoy what we post. We are this close to reaching 100 subscribers as of this moment. We're at 97. Stop sniffing my armpit overlords. And also, one more thing is, be sure to like this video. Oh my god. Be sure to like this video. And also, yeah, I told you to subscribe. Comment down below if you want to see more videos like this. And yeah, without further ado, let's get right into the video. So first things first is that you see that in past videos there have been beds along here, like so many beds. Well, I moved them, and with Overlords' help, I was able to create the Ice Ain't Sleepery. It's a hotel, or a sleepery. <laughs> Called Ice Ain't Sleepery. Yeah, that was pretty smart, wasn't it? Smart name. Right, guys? Um, I'm not 100% sure about that. Ice Ain't Sleepery. Get it? It's a sleepery. Um, couldn't we have just called it up? Well, I don't know, actually, but uh, it's okay. What are you doing? <laughs> should, we, the, should we show off the gold? Yeah, we will. But the next thing really to... Nice. The shopping district got a new banner design, and this is it. Pretty cool? I think so. Yeah, let us know in the comments below if you think this needs any changes. The next thing I wanted to show you is in this direction. It is the the what is it called banner house that has uh teamed up with uh zural and capcom i did show you this before but now it's actually in business and has been getting a bunch of diamonds so that's quite cool next things next is over here pop oh god so this is a uh, not really a shop but uh, more of a carrot farm inside this place because Zero is planning on making a golden carrot farm a golden carrot shop is what I meant not farm using this farm and another farm that I'll show you right now Ugh. the gold farm got a new upgrade which adds an automatic sorting system which can sort between golden nuggets rotten flesh golden ingots Feathers, because some zombie pigment babies can ride chickens, which will give off feathers. And this one, I forgot what it sorts, but nothing in yet. I also forgot what it sorts, also forgot what it sorts, also forgot what it sorts. But this one is cooked chicken, because those chicken tend to give off raw, raw chicken, which can go to the, the, the super smelter and go back into the system. But yeah, that is a thing I'm wondering about. Why are there so little pigmen? Like, there's literally nothing. There's only two, I think. Nah, not now. I don't really want to show it anyway. I just want to show that this thing works. It's It should be better. I don't know. Something's affecting mob cap. Maybe because we're using, you know, mine hut. But yeah, there's a lot of things that can go wrong. Especially, oh wait, I thought I was lagging. Anyways, I, uh, Overlord's invited me to his base to show me something. He hasn't told me yet what it is, but I think he, he seemed pretty excited about it. So let's go pay that a visit. Alright, so we are going to go to his base right about now. Wait for me. Are you doing the... Okay, so, uh, wait, hold on a second. Whatever happened to the Tree of Death? Did you notice this, Overlords? Did you notice that the Tree of Death has turned back into the Tree of Life? Did you notice it? Oh. All three. Wow. Must have happened while we were building it. Yeah, I haven't paid... I... Wow. That is quite Wait, cool. Did you put torches here? Anyways, what was the other thing you wanted to show me? Okay. Nice. Um... In this uh, section. Section or like what? No, you're. Oh, he made the pathway, the tunnels. You wanted to show me that. Oh, that's quite fancy. I like this with the stone slabs. 
It's really nice. But wait, I want to just visit the Tree of Life again. Be and wait, do you still have a copy of the book? Okay, where is it? I read about the tree gods. They said legend has it that if the cop, if it was restored, the tree of life from the tree of death, we just need to burn the copies of the books and the curse just goes away. Just like that. So are you ready for this, overlords? And my book is gone. My book is gone. Is your book gone? Throw it. Yeah. Okay. Wait, something's shaking. Whoa, what's happening? Whoa! What is what? <laughs> it looks the, like the ritual worked. Wait, is that diamonds? Ah, uh, oh, come in, Venus War and Overlords. You have uh, done great things in order to reach here. Not every player is destined to come here. People were chopping wood for so long. I saw Overlords, and you are the player that could solve this issue. Today, there's more wood in this world because of Overlords, and I couldn't be happier to present to you your prize. Look at this pedestal! That is, oh my god, is that an angel? And what's this? What's, what is it wearing? Um, a medal of honor. You know what? This belongs to the person that defeated the curse and made Minecraft reborn. And the person that has done that was Overlord. So come here. This isn't mine. This belongs to you. Oh, the Tree of Life has been restored and it grants us with these. Awesome! You know what, Overlords? You can you can decide how much we get and you can keep the rest. Thanks! I got one. Now, I got one diamond from this, this whole Tree of Life quest. You know what? See you, Angelic Angel. I'm out of here. This was fun. So, from the shopping district to here, I got 20 diamonds, and that's going to add to my ever-increasing collection of money. I like money. I love myself a lot of money. How much money do I have? Let's find out. After this advertise- I'm joking. Uh, wow, that's a lot of moolah. Uh, <laughs> let's go- Um, uh, how should I explain? You know what I'm just going to tell you? It's- about two and a half, I think, stacks of blocks. That's a lot. Yeah, it's about two and a half stacks. 21, guys, 22, 3, um, 4, 5, 6. It's good. Wait, um, guys, can mobs spawn in Mushroom Field Shores? Um, no. If it says Mushroom in it, then no. Uh, I don't mind, I don't have uh, I have to go back to my base. Uh. So, there is one thing in this server that has been and will continue to be used. Except for me, I never used it until now. I want to start getting these things because, well, it's important. It really is. And it is none other than the Ender Chest. I haven't been tackling or using it at all. So in today's episode, I'm just gonna put in some basic necessities or things I'm gonna need from a day-to-day -day basis in that thing. So yeah, let's get let's do it. So the reason I'm here inside the what is it called the end is to get myself some Ender Pearls and to get myself a lot of obsidian because obsidian is needed to make uh, Ender Chests and yeah, the only reason I'm here is because of the Ender Chest that I need it. Why are there so many Endermen inside this? Wait, I'm looking for Blaze Rods. Is there a Blaze Rod? Oh my God, I dropped my trident. I picked it up again. Uh, no, no, no. Yes, there's my blaze rods. It's either this or with a, yeah, like that, 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 that. And if we go find myself a crafting bench, I can just do this, put this in the middle, and four ender chests just like that. You know what? Let's go back into the nether right now, and let's sort my ender chest. Okay, so first things first, I would like to have myself an ender chest right where? Right there. Fine. Why not? Then I want to have three empty shulker boxes in there. And, um, what else? Okay, so I do know that I actually... You know what? Is that my silk touch? Yeah. You need a silk touch to mine ender chests, otherwise they don't come out full. 
But right now, I'm thinking remove that and replace it with this. Keep my gem box in there and my redstone box in there. That way, things are, you know, better. And I do have a duplicate, so let me put my two in there. So places I visit often are like the shopping district. That's one of the places where I visit a lot. And the reason I came up with this whole ender chest idea and trying to think of things to fill it with is because I actually needed it for this. I wanted to go a little bit of shopping in Overlord's shop because I had to get something. Wait, is it... Um, Overlord's, is it restocked? Is the shop restocked? Your shop? Yeah, Overlord's just checked. It's in stock. So let's go do some shopping, shall we? So let's keep my gem chest there, this thing there, and take my five. What do I want to buy? Oh lord, don't you dare take... Yeah, you better run. So I need to purchase spruce, birch, oak, and acacia. Spruce, birch, and acacia? Yeah, those are the only things. Alright, I want to request that. Spruce, that's acacia. I need to get spruce. Yeah, I already clicked it. Now where's spruce? Here it is. And spruce. And where's acacia? No. Twice, right? Yeah. Spruce, acacia, and birch, right? I need to get birch. There it is, birch. Boop! Uh, but, but acacia, you only get one. Yeah, you're actually right. So let me get another set of uh, acacia. Let me get another set. And how many is that? How much do I owe? Four, right? I owe four diamonds. Okay, let's do that. Okay. And, oh wow, I had enough space for all of that. Not bad. So let's just keep everything in this shulker mm. box. Everything's fine, yeah, with the eight stacks sale. Good. Oh, eight mod. Let's keep my gem box back where it's safe in my ender chest so that nobody can steal from it. Overlords, I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you. This is the diorite destruction device. Wait, and I already unloaded all my diorite. You guys just lo unload everything in these counts. Okay, I... Let me quickly go to the ender chest real quick, and I do need- Hey, why'd you leave? Oh. I need to quickly go to the lotto because I I need one extra shulker box. Hey, wait, in my ender chest, do I have an extra shulker box? Hopefully I took three. I did take three. Yo, that's brilliant. That's actually the perfect amount. Let's- We're gonna do the diorite destruction today. No, oh, that's mine. No, ah, no, you took it. Uh, you took uh, it. Uh, do you guys know how it works? Yeah, we put the shulker box in the thing and then the thing. You have my shulker box, put it in this shulker box or whatever. You can throw it to me as well. Let's go to my lotto. So, we're gonna start destroying all the diorite. Let's get started. This is all diorite. Um, boop, and now we need to move on to the next machine. Shouldn't be too hard. It, that one is going to destroy it via cacti. This one is going to destroy it via lava or fire. This one's going to destroy it via fire. And this one's going to be destroying it via lava. This is going to be pretty. If I can actually land on top of it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. No. No. I can make it. I can make it. I knew I could and I did. Boop. And would you look at that. All the diorite. This is good. Now the server will be free of the diorite. Now that is... We mined up all the diorite on this server. So, now we're all burning it, destroying it via cacti and everything. You're all gonna die. I'm just gonna let it continue to do its thing. Why did I place a pumpkin here? Because I didn't need to. Yeah. How much wood did I lose? I just want to know. I lost so much wood. Oh, acacia. The most expensive type of wood. Eh, it's okay. I have a lot of diamonds. I'm going to buy another set. Uh, I was foolish enough, so let me just buy another set. You can just go to Overlord's base and just like... I could, but I'm a nice corner. person. And I'm not allowed to use it anyways. So I'm not going to use it. Instead, I'm gonna- I hate phantoms! I hate them! 
this is lag at its finest. Just get away. Okay. So now the reason I gathered up all this wood is because this thing has been here for so long. And it is the parking garage. This place was to be a sanctuary for boats. A storage place for boats. But unfortunately, I haven't built it yet. So people have just blocked it up with whatever materials they could find. Like orange concrete, gray concrete, and this. So today I'm actually going to... Oh my god. I'm going to actually do it. I'm going to build it. And you'll see exactly how I build it in this time lapse. took me up around 10 minutes a little bit more this hat is like a sanctuary for many boats so that whatever overlords you know doesn't have any boats and he wants to get someplace steal one of these boats and return it and he can just drive off wherever he wants to go i didn't hear what the second part of what you said uh well, i'm just gonna choose to ignore that and um yeah just gonna choose to ignore that nice let me repeat what I said. You have to return it back. You don't understand? Well, I'll make you understand. I understand, sir. Don't do this to me. <laughs> okay, bye bye! So, while everything was going, happening, and all that, uh, uh, Zerl has been working on his shop. Man, I get everybody's survivalists' <laughs> names confused. But Zerl has been working on his shop while we were working on everything else. So, let's go pay him a visit. Maybe we can offer maybe some tricks of the trade or two. So, let's do it. So, okay, so this is your shop. You've got some work to do. What's this? Um, uh, here lies King Boaty. King Boaty is beloved by his boat subjects. Anyone who takes King Boaty shall feel the vengeance of the VN Plays crew. So, don't take him. King Boaty is the true Boaty. Anyways, so yeah, that's gonna wrap things up. Anyways, if you did enjoy this video, please leave a big fat thumbs up. That'd be greatly appreciated. And also, please do subscribe to this channel so we can release the 100 subscriber special. We are at 97 as of this moment, and I know that number can improve. So yeah, hit that subscribe button if you really did enjoy what we post. Please leave a big fat thumbs up, and also please comment down below if you enjoyed this video or not, or any questions or comments you have for me, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Good bye, everybody!